Welcome today be the day that we get promoted to the National League for the first time of asking. Hello and welcome to Club One, part eight of the Globe Explorers. In today's episode we shall be playing our playoff semi-final against Bath and if we win that, the playoff final. Uh, but we might not get we not we might not even get past Bath City because we did lose against and we yeah, we did lose against them last time we played them. Only one nil, but it's still a loss. Then we did draw against them the first time we played them. Obviously Tom Lapsley got set off which should never have been sent enough. I'm not gonna show you it because it's it's just gonna infuriate me. So let's get straight in to the semi final. I'm not sure when the final actually is. I assume it's soon because we've got two players joining on the 5th of May and that's when the transfer window opens so I'm not sure what happens if the, that, that, the, the final is on the 5th. I, I doubt it but it might be. So the lineup will be Holstead. Oh really? Holstead? Are you serious going into the playoff final? No. No really not. Right on bangs playing. Then we've got back four Krask Marshall, Moxie and Martin, Dawson and McGavin in the midfield. They've got Stobbs on the right, Ross Lang on the left, Trumpet and Walker up front. I mean, look at this. Started 11. This is absolute trash. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so don't need him on the bench. So we've got centre mid, we've got a winger, we've got a striker, we've got a full back, so we need a centre back. Who are we going to have on the bench? Uh, Doherty is suspended. Uh, I guess we'll have to have Parsons on the bench. He's only young, but he's going to have to do it. Might not cut him, might, we might, we, we'll try our hardest not to bring him on. Because he is only young, but if we have to, I, I guess we have to. Come on, let's get a win. Let's get through to the final. Looks like Welling beat Yeovil. I think, I think they beat Yeovil. Come on, lads. I, I would very much love to get at least a couple goals this first half, please. Why the... Is Tristan Abraham's going to score in the 55th minute? I'm not sure what's going on there. I really don't. Marks. Oh, please don't. Morani, please get upfield. Oh, that's a very good save from Daryl Umbang. Good save. Actually, what am I saying? That... Glitch over there that just happened literally a couple of minutes ago. Tristan Abrahams doesn't play for Bath, he plays for Chelmsford. So I don't know what's gone on there. I really don't. The uh, yeah, Abrahams plays for Reading, not Chelmsford, Reading United. I don't know, I really don't know why I'm there. Football manager's been a bit glitchy lately, not for me, but other people has. Chumps here, Moxie, come on, let's get the ball in the box. Marshall, Dawson, have a crack from there. Krask, come on. Yes! Chump it! I'm not even going to try and pronounce his first name because I can't pronounce it, but I can pronounce his last name, Chump it! Well done. We are 1 0 up with 10 minutes left to play of the first half. That's not a bad scoreline going into half time. Come on, lads. Come on. Yes, come on. We are 45 minutes away from reaching our first ever playoff final in this series. Come on. 40 minutes left of the game. We'll give it about 10 more minutes and we will make our first couple of substitutions. Come on, lads. Come on. Right, substitution time. Right, I don't think... Bath have really done anything in the first 15 minutes of the first half. Right, we're going to get on Dylan Crow for Krask. Ross Lang off for Francis. Hmm. We'll leave, we'll leave the third substitution for now. Well, half an hour left. Let's just, let's try and get a second goal. Oh, I don't like this. Tom Smith. Oh, please don't. Oh, I don't. How are the, I've just noticed this. Both of our kits are yellow. Huh? Is that not a bit clashy? I don't think it is. One of them's sort of darkish yellow. Yeah, ours is bright yellow. Oh no, Fletcher puts... Oh, my good God, it hits the post. I thought it was going to go into the goal. I thought that was one all, but thankfully we live to fight another day. 
Oh wow, that was that was really close. It goes back far. They're they're getting close to an equalizer. I'd like to get a goal, another goal, please. I don't want to concede. I really don't. Come on, trumpeteer. No, that's absolutely terrible. Cook does put the ball into the back of the net for the equaliser with 15 minutes left to play. We're going to get a Trump. No. Yeah, we'll get. No, we'll get off Walker. Because um, he's not had a good game. Trumpeteer can go in the advance. We could be in the advance for him. Yeah, that's fine. Come on. Come on, lads. 15 minutes left. Uh, does it go straight to penalties? I, I looked at the rules last episode. I think it goes. It might go to half time. Uh, extra time, I mean. It's already been half time. Oh no, 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 please don't. Somebody get a tackle in, for the love of God. Leeson, Smith, Marks. Oh, I don't like this. Bath, I'm, I'm never really going for it now. We've got to let's drop some encouragement. Come on, lads, come on. Come on, let's get a goal. Another goal, please. Five minutes left. Is anything going to happen in this? Oh, come on, McGavin. Whips in. Jarvis! Yes, it's a goal for Aaron Jarvis and that does put us in the lead with just a couple of minutes left to play. I don't think I don't think Bath have got the energy to get another goal. Yes! We've done it! We're into the final of the Fanarama South playoffs. Oh my god, we are one game away from at least I think we're one game away from the National League. I don't think there's any other shenanigans that can possibly go on. We do play Welling, who we did beat in the last episode, I think. Was it in the last episode? No, yes, it was. We beat them 2-0 in the last episode. That should be quite an easy an easy game. So, oh, I've never been in this situation before. I can't remember the last player final I actually played against in. Uh, so, we are 19 minutes away from reaching the National League for the first time ever in this save. Well, this is strange. Um, two players have joined. They've joined us before the before the playoff final. I mean, I don't know what else to say, but I'll just introduce them in now. I mean, I may as well because it's before the match. So, first side in Josh Nichols, seventeen year old right back, can play left back, but he's coming to be our first choice right back for next season. Three and a half star current ability, five, four and a half star potential. National League standard player at the moment. We signed him from Arsenal on a free transfer, so should be quite a good signing. Then next signing is Harrison Harrison Dutchek. He's a English sentiment, eighteen year old, eighteen years old. Three and a half star current ability, five star potential. He's a sentiment, so we will be signing him for a three and a half star current ability, five star potential. He's a sentiment, so we will be changing tactics for next year. Probably won't be playing the forty four. Because I don't, it's good for this level, but I think we need to make a slight tackle to call change. He's a good National League player, potentially you need to. Again, once again, signing for Master on a free transfer, so two very good players. I didn't think they'd be, um, I didn't think they'd join before this game. I'm not sure if they could be actually involved. I think they can, but I doubt it. So, the lot no, 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 no. Holstead is not playing. Not in the playoff final. No. Just no. In fact, on bang. Is he out of contract? He is still out of contract at the moment. So the lineup will be on bang and goal. A back four of Krask, Doherty, Moxie and Martin. Dawson and Hansen in the midfield. They've got Francis on the right. Endicott on the left. Trumpeter and Walker up. But why are we playing Trumpeter and Walker? I'm gonna no, I'm gonna start my strongest attack. And that is Aaron Jarvis and Lewis Collins. That's our best attack. Advance forward. I don't, I don't even know what is Lewis Collins actually that good anymore? Right, well that's the strike force we're going with this game. Hull said it's not gonna go so we've got Josh Nichols, one of our new signings, somehow played on the bench this game, don't know how that's possible, I really don't. So we need, we've got two centre mids on the bench, like Ace Hall, you're not going to be on the bench, unfortunately, so centre back, centre back. Ross Marshall can go on the bench, so we also need a winger, so Jack Stobbs can go on the bench. Right, 
Big Hearted team is pretty good. Come on, lads. Let's get, let's get promoted, shall we? I, I think we can. We should be winning this game fairly comfortably. Come on, we're not even at Wembley. This is an absolute outrage, this is. Maybe uh, the Valorama National Playoff is definitely at Wembley. I know that. Jarvis. That's a crack. It's just over the top of a crossbar. It's a decent effort. But was the shot the right option? I think he should pass it, personally. But who am I to say? Oh, no. Oh, no. You silly boy. Right, we're not going to make any changes. We'll just put Collins on the wing. Right, he could be a... We'll keep, still keep him as impressive for We'll just swap over the two wingers. That's fine. Right, we're, we're, we're in the poopies now. And that's all because of Endercott, the scum bag. Come on, 25 minutes left of the uh, first half. If we could get into our time nil nil, I think that'd be a very good achievement considering we are down to 10 men. Though we are looking like scoring a goal here. Francis, that's a chance to have a shot. He does. It does clip uh, just the top of the netting. Very good, good chance. Chance we should, probably should have done better at, but. If we had two strikers on the pitch, uh, well, another player on the pitch, we might have actually scored for that opportunity. But 15 minutes left of the first half, I don't... This isn't a bad first half, considering we are down to 10 men, so I'll take it. I'd rather have 11 men on the pitch and 10. Come on. I'll take this uh, going into half time. I will definitely take it. It's not bad. Not bad, we have always been a second half team, don't forget. Keep going, we can still win this if we work hard. Come on, lads. Come on, up the mighty yellows. Come on. 40 minutes left, I will give about... Oh, no. This is going to be a goal, isn't it? Mitchell. Yep. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it was going to be a goal. Come on, lads. Martin, let's get let's try and get a pretty quick reply, please. Francis, Martin, come on. Moxie, Martin, let's get the ball in the box. Quit passing around the back. Let's get the ball in the box and have a, try and have a couple of shots. Collins, oh, he could have been through. He could have been through a goal. He nearly was. Dawson, come on. Dawson, that's a crack. What a goal from Kevin Dawson. And that does put us level within barely a couple of minutes from conceding. We've also we've already scored. So, yeah, that's that's very good. Like, one minute later. Wow. I don't, I don't think it was barely a minute. Probably about 30 seconds. Oh, well, we are going to... Yeah, we're going to make some subs now. I was going to take off Kevin Dawson, but I'm not going to now. We're going to get on... We're going to get on Tom Lapsy for Hanson. He can just go, yeah, go, yeah, that's fine. Is he not, is he only four stars now? He was four and a half stars last game. Right, Krask is going to come off for Josh Nichols making his um, debut. That's, that seems strange saying that. Mind you, the transfer window has actually opened. It hasn't confirmed it yet, but it is now open. So oh, that's a little bit strange. All right, come on. We've got 20 minutes left of the game. Reading, I'd say they've been the better team, but if we could somehow grab a winning goal, that'd be absolute fantastic. All right, 10 minutes left. I think it is probably going to go to extra time. Let's try to bounce some more in the last five minutes. Let's see if we can get something. Just like a highlight or anything. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 this copy. no, 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 please don't, no, Abrahams, oh, sod off, well done on bag, upfield, come on, it's extra time, ah, I, I did want this to go extra time, um, uh, I think we've been uh, very unlucky so far, we've done nothing wrong, yet, but I think we, I think we can still get a goal, <sighs> come on, Bennett, please don't, and it's a goal for Lewis Wright. Reading are now 2-1 up. 
this is this is a shambles this game if we hadn't have had this red card so early on we, i reckon we would be in this situation i reckon we would have won by now or we'll be winning Alright, substitution time. Collins is going to come off for subs. Moxie's going to come off. Yeah, we can make another change. That's good. Alright, come on, lads. Come on. We're going to go attacking for the final 15 minutes. We're going to drop some encouragement in the hope we can find a late equaliser and possibly send it to penalties. Come on, lads. Nothing's going to happen. Nothing's going to happen! Oh my god. We lost in the playoff final. Well, there goes my big chance of having a rebuild. Um... <laughs> what a disaster. I am embarrassed by that performance. Absolute shameful. You... Endicott. <sighs> oh. Well, I guess I'll just uh, see you all tomorrow in our transfer special where hopefully we have a big rebuild. If you have enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more Daily Football Manager videos, and thank you very much for watching!